of dollars for fire station renovations, improvements in Moncrief, and transforming a historic film studio. Those are some of the new capital improvement projects the mayor could ask the city council for on Monday as part of his budget. New at 6, Action News Jack's Jenna Bourne joins us live to break it down. Jenna, you got an advanced copy of the latest numbers in that budget. And keep in mind, these numbers and projects could change by the time the mayor introduces his proposed budget to council on Monday, but we wanted to give you a sneak peek. You're about to look at a bird's eye view of Fire Station 10 in Riverside. Right now, firefighters have to back their trucks into the bays, but the property and structures behind it are for sale. The city could spend $1.8 million to buy these properties and create drive through bays, which are safer for firefighters. A million dollars would be an absolute um, renovation of this entire interior of this property. And that's the dollar figure proposed for Norman Studios in the latest version of the mayor's proposed capital improvement program, or CIP. One million dollars could go to rehabbing the only surviving film studio complex in Jacksonville so it can transform into a museum and education center. It would allow us to put in all the systems that are needed, you know, everything that you need, HVAC, plumbing, electrical, etc. The proposed CIP also includes new funding next fiscal year for renovations at fire stations 10 in Riverside and 20 in Love Grove. The mayor could also ask for more than two million for Moncrief Road beautification and work on a Moncrief community center. As we approach these next four years, moving the jail out of downtown is one of my goals. The CIP includes $246 million to replace the jail, but it's listed in the beyond five years column for now. In the meantime, the city could spend more than $15 million on upgrades, maintenance, and a cell door system at the current jail. Now, this is just a small sampling. The CIP includes hundreds of projects. Some are new. Some are projects the city has been working on for years. We'll get the full budget proposal from the mayor's office on Monday. Reporting live in the studio, Jenna Bourne, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News, Jax.